Every weekend during football season, our team travels the country from stadium to stadium to find the most fabulous food, outrageous super fans, radical rigs, and coolest setups. This week, we're in sunny San Diego searching for the craziest tailgaters at the queue. So join us as we charge into Bolt's territory and party with the hottest fans in the league. So put on your colors, plant your folding chairs by the grill, because... Lots here at Qualcomm are filling up, and already you can feel it in the air. These fans in San Diego, they know how to get charged up about their tailgate. The great weather, a winning record, it's a guarantee that this tailgate's gonna be pumping. You can already smell the great food. It's got my stomach grumbling. Let's go see what we can fill it up with. So Jay's off to taste the offerings of the queue and find this week's contestants who will battle in a taste off at Party Central. Our custom rad trailer built by our friend Manny. It's got all you need for a great tailgate, including built-in grill and wet bar, large seating area for all your buds, and a killer stereo to rock the blacktop with. Looks like Jay's found his first taste. Show me what you got on the grill. Stingray, Try one of those stingray tacos. Stingray tacos. Stingray tacos. I, of course I want one. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Tell me the story of this stingray taco. The stingray taco? I mix it with marlin and dorado, and I just boil it. Then Cook the, all the vegetables separate and then throw it in there, mix it. And this, there it is, right this, here. This is fantastic. It is good. It, it tastes like lobster. It does, it's good. Stingray tacos you in San Diego. Them? We see some good stuff over here on the grill. We got a little turf and surf going on here because we're in the playoffs. We're, talk, we're not talking wieners today. No wieners, <laughs> huh? Big game. Today. Big game today. We're pulling it all out. Beautiful lobster tails. I love it. Now, what's your sauce? What are you going to use on that? Uh, a little uh, butter garlic. Just a little for butter dipping. garlic. That's right. Just for a dip. That's right. Beautiful. It's perfect, guys. Cut All right, garlic. go Seahawks. No. <laughs> go Chargers. That's right. All right, guys. Hey, thanks a lot. How's it going, guys? Oh, what do we got here? Oh, yeah, sausage and peppers. I'm going to grab a pepper if that's all right. All you have to do is kick back. Oh, they cook perfect. Not too soggy, but just right. Nice and crunchy. Good flavor. Excellent pepper. Right off the grill. They look perfect, actually. Really good. Mushrooms, onions, peppers, and some uh, hot Italian sausage. Excellent. We had some homemade jambalaya here, way over here on the West Coast. And we're here with uh, JB and JC. Uh, let's go ahead and taste some of this right off of the stove. And it looks fantastic. That's pretty good flavor. Not what's bad, that, what's the secret ingredient in that? Well, we got a little Tabasco in there. We got some jambalaya chicken and some sausage and just charge your love. It's not too hot. Normally when people think of a jambalaya, they think hot, spicy, right. they can't handle it. That's, right. that's really good. You want to try a rib? Do I want to try a rib? Do you have to ask? Here we go. We're going to try ribs. So what do you got on these ribs? We got a little uh, raspberry chipotle barbecue sauce and a little Cajun spice mix, a little salt and pepper. Cooked them all night long. Raspberry chipotle. It's raspberry chipotle. That's oh, a good flavor there. Oh, look at that. I get a napkin and everything. Now, raspberry just kind of brings yeah, a whole new flavor a to the sweet, meat. sweet little heat. Yep. All right, guys. Thank right. you so much. You Appreciate it. it. That's all right. I all got right. All right. There we go. <laughs> Thanks a lot, man. Go Chargers. Go Chargers. Coming up, more tailgaters, this tailgate's favorite crustacean, and Jay selects our first contestants for the cook-off. Every team has their fanatics, the fan that goes all out to show his colors. Body paint, face paint, wigs, and more. There is no limit to what these fans won't do to support their team. This week, we go to a galaxy far, far away as Tailgate Party picks Stormtrooper of the queue as our fanatic fan of the week. May the grill be with you. Here at the queue, we're only miles from Mexico. It's an area rich with historic missions and haciendas. Cultures and languages blend across the border, flavoring everything from the art 
to the music, to the food. Here in the tailgating, Mexican favorites like carne asada, costillas, and fajitas sizzle on the grill and on the tongue. We're with Manuel, and what do you got for us here today? Carne asada and beer sausages. So are you gonna give us a taste of this wonderful food? Yes, we will. This is my special marinade, bro. This is the special charger marinade. So I'm gonna taste this. Really tender. That melts in your mouth. That's a good steak there. Thank you so much, Manny. We'll see you over at the taste stop. You're welcome. All right. Here we go. Hey guys, this looks like something awesome. What do you got going here? Those are huge steaks. What's the marinade? What's the seasoning on the steak? Okay, it's uh, garlic salt and just uh, regular pepper. We rub it in on both sides and then we, we go ahead and barbecue it. What we do with the shrimp is we just go ahead and this. We have a dip for it already which is butter, garlic, and... A little bit of lemon juice. A little, a little bit of lemon, lemon juice, juice, sure. We don't put it over there, we just cook it, and then you dip it like you would lock. Kind of simple, just to enhance right. the flavor rather right. than exactly. take it out. Okay, exactly. fantastic. Well, that exactly. looks great, guys. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Thank you. Thank you. Well, here we are with Dan. We found uh, something that looks outstanding on the grill. What do you got? Dog nuts, brother. Dog nuts. Dog nuts. Dog nuts. Explain what a dog nut is. A little bit of pepperoncini. A little carne asada and some bacon. Very nice. You got to try one. I got to try, gotta try one. one. Okay. Oh, hot, right, 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 right off the grill. It's a little hot. Go ahead. It's a little chill. Yeah, a little hot. It's, it's gonna hot. be hot for you. Go ahead. Whole thing, bro. Dog nut. It's gonna be good. Yeah, better feel all of it. All of it. All of it. All of it. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. A little bite to it. <laughs> There's a little bite to it. I got a little teary eyed right now. You won't be clogged up, I promise you. Okay, Talk we're having a tailgating it. contest. We got um, we got a couple celebrity judges. We're going to be in lot K1. We have a big trailer set up over right. there. I would like you to compete. I think these are fantastic. You have to do Jake Jr., Jr., and Jake Sr. And uh, explain to us what this is. There's king crab in there. There's mussels, clams, cod, uh, cod, uh, peppers, onions, garlic. Yeah, all that good stuff. Everything good. And it's called Chirpino. Chirpino. And the okay. recipe's from New England. It's from Connecticut, which is where I'm from. Fantastic. All right, guys. It works. Hey, it works. congratulations. You I'd bet. like you guys to uh, come over and be a we'll finalist do. in our uh, contest. <laughs> Every tailgate has its common thread. Sometimes it's brats, sometimes burgers, but there's always one grilling delight that dominates. This week, it's a little pink crustacean that is rampant at the queue. What do we got here on the grill? We got a little shrimp. We got some shrimp. What we do with the shrimp, Kurt tells me that he farms his own shrimp. Up next, Jake finds our final contestant, rig at the blacktop, and we'll meet our judges as we head into the taste off. safe from a fanatic's touch. Cars, RVs, it's all fair game when it comes to showing your team pride. Here at the Q, we picked Super Stretch. Coming in at a whopping 40 feet long, it's our radical rig of the blacktop. All right, we're here at the vault, baby. Yeah! What do we got here on the grill? We got a little shrimp. Ribs coming. Yeah, dip and go. <laughs> dip and go. Where are you from? Temecula, San Diego. Stadium has that, all right? That's right. 
Jay's tasted food at every tailgate in the NFL, and he's confident that the four contestants today are going to make San Diego proud. Abigail with Miria, Jake's Trapino, Dan with his dog nuts, and Manuel's Charger Asada. Now that we know who's competing, let's meet our judges. First up, Chef Bernard Diaz is the award-winning chef from San Diego's landmark marine room at the La Jolla Beach and Tennis Club. Literally steps from the crashing waves, Chef Bernard presents a whole world of culinary expertise on every plate. And, in spite of impressive credentials, he's just a real cool guy. Chef Brian Malarkey brings his colorful personality and a load of seafood from his native Oregon coast into the kitchen at the Ocean Air in the heart of the historic gas lamp district. Executive chef of the swank and popular San Diego location, he's a fixture on the food scene around here. And last but not least, Kelly Gates is right at home sharing the stage with a couple of hands. She spends her mornings laughing at the antics of L.A. radio personalities Mark and Brian as part of their nationally syndicated radio show. When she's not reading the news or using her sharp wit to show the guys up at trivia, she's probably taking somebody's money in a poker tour. Now that the pieces are in place, let's move on to the taste-off. taste off here for the best tailgater in Chargers territory our three celebrity judges our first one is Kelly Gates is a morning show personality at KLOS here in nearby LA how you doing rock and roll all right you ready <laughs> to taste some food I am this is very exciting thank you for having me Excellent. I'm, I'm with the pros over here though but uh, having a good time, having a good time. I'll well, be kind of like it's really good or hmm not so good but they're the real the real deal here that's good we love having you <laughs> and next we have our uh, famous chef Bernard Gios from Yay. the marine room at the local La Jolla Beach and Tennis Club How you, you doing, chef? It. it's great it's great to be here go Chargers I gotta tell you great food it's one of my first time in America tailgating and I gotta tell you man it is unbelievable it's a party yeah. a it's party a on a parking lot I love it our next celebrity judge is chef Brian Malarkey he's from the Ocean Air in our downtown San Diego historic okay, gas lamp yeah. district. How you doing, Brian? Very good. Thanks for having us today. You bet. This is gonna be great. Uh, come out here, a little blacktop party in the Chargers. We're in town. We're loving it. We got a playoff game today. Great food. Great time. Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. A little dissension Whoa. among the ranks. Abigail's sons dragged her out into the lots just to cook for them and their buddies, and you got to hear them brag about their mom's birria. They should. This spicy Mexican dish is a fantastic example of the family gems you can turn up at any tailgate party. Let's see what our judges think. Is it gonna be spicy? No. no? Very good. You just never know what you're gonna find when you peek into a pot out here on the blacktop. And Jay says this next entry was totally unexpected. An Italian fish stew prepared by a family from New England in honor of the Patriots' playoff visit to the queue. Jake's Trapino was truly inspired. Uh, okay, what's the name of this dish again? New England Chipino. Chipino is how it's pronounced. And you got some mussels and, and oysters shrimp. and clams and shrimp and a little fish in here with a, a fantastic broth. The chefs really enjoyed it. Our judges loved it. So uh, right. what do you think so far? You think you got a chance? I oh, think hey, we this, got a chance, just it. like the Chargers have got a chance today. All right, well, hey, good luck with the Chargers. I hope they can beat New England, but this is fantastic. There's no one can beat this. Up next, these tasty little bites are something Dan likes to call dog nuts, and he tells us they are always served in pairs. Carne asada and maple bacon wrapped around a pepperoncini and tossed on the grill. One bite, and the judges went wild. Here at the queue, you can't toss a ball without tripping over a pile of carne asada. It's everywhere. Grilled flank steak marinated a long time in citrus and spices. It's so popular in the San Diego area, they serve it over everything from eggs to french fries. Manuel served his up the traditional way with guacamole and warm tortillas. Now that all our contestants have presented their dishes, let the judging begin. The judges awarded five points for presentation, five points for originality and regional flair, and 10 points for taste for a total of 20 points. Wow, what a tough decision. Who's our spokesperson for the judges? Is it Paula? Is it Randy? 
Or is it Simon? It's Simon! Oh, it's Simon! It's Simon. I don't want to be Simon. Come on, Simon. Who it is? Who it is? All right, after tough, tough decision making here, first of all, thank you all. Go Chargers. We had a great time. The food was great. The past was wonderful. But the winner in all categories and a unanimous decision, no point intended, the winner is, is it Double Down Dog Nuts? Dog Nuts! Dog Nuts! So there you have it. Dance Dog Nuts smoked the competition and gets chosen as Tailgate Party's Dish of the Black Dot for this week. We want to thank our contestants for all the great food and the queue for such a hot tailgate. Now let's get back to Jay and find out where we're going next. Join us next week as we travel across the country to Jacksonville, Florida for another episode of... We got your